Assalamualaikum. For this video, the topic is dipole moment and bond polarity. Okay. So, example molecule hydrogen chloride. Okay. So, this is covalent molecule. Okay. So, when we look here. Okay. This is a covalent bond where the electron share um, one electron share from hydrogen and one electron share from fluorine. Okay. However, okay, each atom has different electronegativity. Okay, that uh, makes electron share attracted more towards fluorine. Okay, here. Okay, because fluorine is more electronegative compared to hydrogen. So, electron is attracted more towards atom fluorine and makes the this region very high and rich in electron okay so that's why uh, fluorine is partially negative show that they uh, uh, very high in electron okay for this region untuk hydrogen it is electron poor region since electron are more attracted towards fluorine and uh, Hydrogen is partially positive. Okay. So, when this happen, okay, it form a dipole here. Okay. So, uh, this is polar bond and makes the molecule is polar. Okay. For polarity of the molecule, untuk kita nak tentukan uh, that molecule polar or non-polar, first we have to uh, draw based on molecular uh, geometry. Okay, based on Vesper theory. For polar molecule, it is diatomic molecule and composed of different atoms and uh, must have dipole moment where the dipole moment cannot cancel each other. Okay, for non-polar molecule, Diatomic molecule with same element and depends on polarity and shape. Okay. Okay. Uh, so, the related of the uh, symmetry or unsymmetry of the molecule. And then, for non-polar molecule, okay, the molecule must no dipole moment or zero dipole moment. Where the dipole moment can cancel each other. Okay. So, what is di uh, bond dipole and dipole moment? Okay. Um, the dipole uh, moment occur when there is a different in electronegativity of atom. Okay, in molecule. So, contohnya, um, untuk dipole moment, uh, attraction sharing electron here, okay, more attracted. Okay, the electron more attracted toward oxygen, okay, compared to carbon. Alright. So, for each dipole, it has magnitude and vector, okay. It has a value actually. Okay, so we look for carbon dioxide, okay. So, since oxygen has high electronegative compared to carbon, okay, so it will form uh, dipole ok so electron attracted to oxygen compared to carbon ok so sama yang dekat sini juga uh, ke arah oxygen electron share uh, more towards oxygen compared to carbon ok so setiap uh, dipole ni ok dia adalah polar bond ok Tapi molekul, adakah molekul ini polar or non-polar? Okay, kita tengok uh, the dipole moment can cancel each other or not. Okay, so since the uh, molecular geometry is linear, so uh, the shape is symmetry. So when uh, bond dipole can cancel each other, okay, that uh, will result in zero dipole moment. So, the molecule is non-polar. Okay. 
Okay, because the dipole moment can cancel each other since that the electron uh, uniformly distributed. Okay, and then form the uh, non-polar molecule. Okay. Okay, for next example is H2O. So, after draw Lewis structure and then you determine, uh, you draw based on uh, Vesper theory. So, the geometry is bent. Okay, so since oxygen has high electronegativity compared to hydrogen, so the arrow of dipole towards oxygen. Okay, kena buat arrow lah ke arah oxygen. Okay, means that the electron share attracted towards oxygen compared to hydrogen. Okay, belah sini. Okay. Uh, polar bond. Yang belah sini pun sama jugalah. Oxygen attracted, uh, attract. Oxygen attract uh, electron more towards oxygen compared to hydrogen. Okay. So, these two hydrogen oxygen bond identical. Okay. Tapi, shape ni adalah unsymmetrical. And then, the dipole moment uh, go up, okay, towards oxygen for both. And, the dipole moment cannot cancel each other. Okay, not directly opposed to each other. So, the dipole moment cannot cancel each other. So, it has dipole moment. Okay, ada dipole moment. So, the molecule is polar. Okay, so ingat kalau molecule tu polar, dia ada dipole moment. Maksudnya dipole, dipole cannot cancel each other. Okay. Based on uh, here. Okay. For NH3 ammonia. Okay. So based on molecular shape. Okay. Ni adalah trigonal pyramidal. Okay. So kita tengok. Electron share pada bonding pair ni uh, attracted to what atom? Okay. So, actually, nitrogen uh, more electronegative compared to hydrogen. So, arrow of dipole uh, towards nitrogen. Okay. Okay, since the uh, shape is unsymmetrical and... Uh, the dipole go up, okay, towards, all towards nitrogen since nitrogen uh, attract the electron compared to hydrogen. So, the bond is cannot uh, cancel each other for the dipole. Okay, dipole cannot cancel each other and it has dipole moment. Dia ada dipole moment lah. Sebab dipole moment dia bukan kosong. Okay, so that's why the Molecule is polar. Okay, because of the dipole, moment can, uh, the bond dipole cannot cancel to each other. Okay, so it has value. Means the electron are not uniformly distributed. Okay, so makes the uh, molecule polar. Okay, because of the dipole cannot cancel each other. Okay, okay uh, I give ada example, contohnya adalah BF3 boron trifluoride. So, uh, after you draw Lewis structure and then determine the molecular geometry. So, dia adalah trigonal lana. Okay, BF3. Okay, so based on uh, the atom, electronegative, so boron less electronegative compared to fluorine. Okay. Fluorine has high electronegative uh, compared to boron. So, it will okay, mix the electron share attracted towards fluorine okay, for this bond. Okay. Kalau kita tengok setiap bond ni, kita panggil polar bond sebab uh, dia polar lah sebab because uh, electron attracted towards fluorine Okay, uh, so mix the that part high e electron. But either the molecule polar or non-polar based on the dipole. Okay, either it can cancel each other or not. Okay, so uh, kalau kita tengok dah 
aeronya ke arah fluorin. So, okay, since uh, the uh, the shape is trigonal plana and symmetry. So, bila diaper moment ke arah uh, keluar macam ni. So, dia boleh cancel each other. Okay. So, the dipole moment is zero. The molecule BF3 is non-polar. Okay. Because the dipole can cancel each other uh, from the symmetrical shape of trigonal plana uh, and the dipole moment towards uh, fluorine here. So, bila kat arah magnitude uh, vector sana pada symmetrical shape dia akan cancel dipole moment. Okay. So, zero dipole moment for uh, boron trifluoride molecule. So, the molecule is non-polar. Okay. Okay, contoh kalau CH3Cl. Okay, so after you do, do, draw the structure and then uh, determine the molecular geometry. So, that can jadi uh, shape ni adalah tetra hydro. Okay. So, kita tengok um, setiap attraction pada bonding pair here. Attraction of electron. So, compare carbon and chlorine. Okay. Chlorine has okay, high electronegative compare to carbon. So, uh, arrow untuk dipole moment ke arah chlorine. Okay. Untuk carbon dengan hydrogen. Okay. So, carbon has uh, slightly higher electronegativity compared to hydrogen. So, the electron share here are attracted more towards carbon compared to hydrogen. Okay, like this one. So, when we look at the dipole, okay, yang sini ke arah carbon, yang atas ni ke arah chlorine. Okay, so even the, the geometry is symmetry, tetrahedral, tetrahedral, but you look at the uh, dipole, either it can cancel each other or cannot cancel each other. Okay, for this example, the dipole cannot cancel each other. Okay, so uh, it has dipole moment. Okay, so this molecule is polar or non-polar. If the molecule has type of moment, okay, the molecule is polar. Right? Okay, this is for exercise. You are, please try the exercise.